The point array has its name because it is an array and it mimics a point source. A point source is an infinitely small point from which sound radiates in all directions. And some people believe that's the best way, theoretically, to reproduce music. But of course, it's not practical. You can't have an infinitely small point that produces sound in all directions. But the point array mimics the point source because it is an array. It's an array of nine drivers in a ring, and there's no boundary from one driver to the next. They're in continuous. And it has in its geometric center, or point, if you will, which could be determined by if you took the axis of all nine of these drivers, they would converge on a point. And at that point is where the tweeter is. We went through many steps to validate the point array technology, going from having a concept of what we wanted it to sound like, to building prototypes, to testing prototypes. The key to doing the prototyping was 3D printing. The point array is comprised of a 3D printed part of carbon filled copolyester. As we got closer and closer to the final solution of what was required to get the sonics that we needed, we realized 3D printing was the most practical, if not the only way, to produce the point array. When we had a prototype that sounded good, we had it measured with a clipple machine, which emulates a anechoic chamber to where you're getting the radiation pattern from the speaker without interference from any wall reflections. The clipple machine has a microphone that is in many positions, and in every position it measures the frequency response, and then it moves to a different position and measures it, different position measures it, all the way around the speaker as well as up and down. So you get a 360 degree frequency response, not only on axis towards the listener, but also off axis around the whole room. And that gives you a quantitative measurement in how the speaker's performing. And then when we had something internal that we thought was awesome, we looked for external validation. We had uh, musicians who had written songs, recorded those songs in a studio, listened to their songs on the Bavira speaker, and say, does this represent what you were trying to communicate in your song? You know, basic things like, can you understand the lyrics? Can you determine what instruments are being played and where they are on the soundstage? And we had a range of musicians come and sit and listen. And tears came to their eyes in some cases. And they said things like, this is the first time since I wrote that song that I've felt the emotion that I had that inspired the creation of the song. And to us, that was the ultimate validation that the artists who had something in mind when they wrote the song that would be experienced by the listeners, they were validating to us that, yes, I am now experiencing what you had in your heart and in your mind when you wrote and recorded the song. That was the highest compliment, the highest level of validation that we could add. Try the Bravura speakers for yourself. With our 30-day risk-free trial, you can evaluate our speakers in your room with your equipment, with the music that you love. We're confident that the Bravura sound system is the best sound in your room. Be the first to know where we'll show up next by following us on Facebook, LinkedIn, and Instagram. You can also receive a discount on your first purchase by signing up for our email newsletter at the link below.